So the office is coming along nicely. It's all been uh, fully uh, dry lined this week, and we've had. Uh, uh, Tony, what's your company called? So the office is coming along nicely. We've had um, Applied Design, uh, which is a company over from Norley, and they've done all the dry lining this week, and they've done all of the taping and jointing on all the boards, and it's looking great in here. It's all coming together. It all feels a lot more solid up here too. All the board inside it all in nicely. So. Uh, conference room's all been done, fully boarded and, and sealed, server room, the offices. Tony's just here now finishing the last few bits of, uh, of jointing and taping. So hopefully, by the end of this week, we'll, uh, we'll be starting painting the walls. Part of this mammoth project is painting the whole thing. So we got Steve, this is Steve Parsons, painter and decorator, and he smashed this out in pretty much two days. How have you got on with it? It's all right, it's been all right. Once it got all sealed up, uh, the joiner went a bit heavy with the nails, but it uh, looked, like looked like he had attacked it with a machine gun. It did have a lot in there. I'll tell you, it's never coming off though, is it? Oh, it's not going to fall off. Well, I'm really, really chuffed with that. I think you've done a great job and it's looking really, really clean now, all in grey. It was a bit of a patchwork quilt of, it was like an extension on an extension, this back bottom building, so it was all a bit yeah. hot wasn't it? Yeah, it look all right now. Now it's all under colour. So that was done yesterday mostly. Uh, there's still a tiny little bit left, but we've got the two big extractors going up through the roof. Uh, and then we've also got this whole frame being constructed as we speak by Paul from Bechtel Fabrications. Uh, they've made this whole frame for us, and it's a custom design to hold our collapsible drying racks. So we're going to have four drying racks next to each other there. Rob and John from Atkinson's of Cheshire are back in again this week. They're hard at work with all the uh, skirting boards and architrying. So we're not far off the usable office. A couple more days in here, and then we've got to do a bit more painting, put the carpet in, and the big one is next week, or late this week, we'll be putting in the suspended ceiling. This is my project for the next probably two days. The server app has just arrived today, so we're going to be having uh, our own in-house server, we're running all of our uh, own network here, and it's going to be all Cat6 back to this cabinet, which is going in our server room. It looks totally different with the plaster board up, doesn't it? All your good uh, joinery work has been covered up by the ceiling. Always the best way of covering up, <laughs> covering up the work you've done. <laughs> oh, it's solid now though. It was solid before, but yeah, it ties it all in, doesn't it? It's good these glass panes are so big because we've literally been able to like forklift pull the plaster board through the window, all the insulation through the window. The server cabinet came in through the window and um, other long lengths of skirt. I don't know if we need glass. We can just have them. <laughs> Access, Access hatch. hatch.